The first time I came to a report to the community and I saw what a tremendous communicator she was, how she just captivated her audience with this positive aurora that surrounds her. I was really kind of blown away by that. She's a visionary. She gets things done. She knows how to motivate people. And she has changed the entire face of not only Cal State San Marcos, but of the city of Temecula too. Cal State San Marcos came into its own because Karen was president. She's woven herself and the university into the very fabric of North County and the community. Uh, and that's incredibly difficult to do. The, the country as a whole, needs the Karen Haynes of the world, and they are not commonly found. I think Karen Haynes' effectiveness is really a result of her communication skills and her absolute integrity. She demonstrates a real willingness to share her achievements with the people that she is working with and basically says, it's not me, it's us. And Jim is included in every single bit of this. With the foster program that he's developed and worked through with the university as well. We were blown away. I think both with the creativity of the program he put together, really based on the needs of former foster youth. You know, a program that really came from his deep understanding of the needs of these young people. Those are things that we appreciate in, uh, as, as a re not only in San Marcos, but as a region. I am always so moved by Jim's spirit and his uh, caring for the students. They have this set of beliefs that a lot of people share, but they live those beliefs and they have built a huge institution based on that. I just don't know anybody else who's done that. Yeah, I think the, the secret sauce for both of them, I think they share uh, tremendous caring and compassion and vulnerability. To have created such an amazing institution that reshapes the lives of so many people, there are a few people who can point to that as their legacy. Karen built this institution so that it would thrive well beyond her tenure. Donors look at that and we look for those kind of leadership qualities. We're so proud of her leadership of San Marcos. What an extraordinary community of learners and leaders this has become. She should be very, very proud of that. She's had a heck of a run. Um, I'm glad to have been a part of that. It's good for me too.